at Goodman Diamond in Madison, Wisconsin. It's the Wisconsin Badgers taking on average and then Denali Lecker, kind of like the Swiss Army knife for this team. A sub to ERA, nine and twelve, however, that has a lot to do with to fire her first strike after that first ball. Carter has to try and get Hawkeyes up. And she grounds this one, the shortstop, and Hubbard fires on the Keller at first and one out in this one. Just textbook. The fielding for the Badgers, Hubbard at shortstop has been solid there, he got, but has been solid batting and also a really great defender. 1-1. Four. One, one. Slapped up the middle and gets through the gap at second base into the outfield. And Iowa gets oh, batting for Iowa, Lecker. The runner on base, this one high hit to Keller in foul territory at first, makes the catch, and Schwartz starts off. Katie Keller, the transfer. The transfer from Northern Illinois, her last year leading the team for one there to finish out her career at Wisconsin. Come in and led this team, especially through the adversity they've had doing the same thing to Adam. And she gets rung up looking, strike three on the full count. Oftentimes this year in the three. So far this season, batting well. Two, one, hit, left field on a line, and it's gone! Kayla Kahn went senior. This couldn't be the more perfect scenario for the fifth year Kayla Conwent. Hasn't had a home run since like we and Wisconsin on the board, 1-0. Again, another first inning run. Weekend series, six of 12 total runs have been scored in the first inning. And this one high in the left field. Klosterman getting back onto the warning track to make the catch. I was with Adams at the center circle. Adams, home oh. run, 10th of the year. Ali Hubbard also having a pretty good Payoff pitch. Outside, ball four up, out there. And the runner on first for the Badgers. Yesterday, where she went with a bunt. In this series, she's hitting two for six. Starting more as of late. And she hits this one, bloop in the left field, and the center fielder, Roman, able to run over to make the catch. And Iowa gets out of the inning. Coming into this series, it was almost like a playoff series, considering where these teams are, how similar today. This one hit, Hubbard at short, throws on the first, and the first out of the inning again. Another Hubbard. For this team, hitting 2-6-1 with two home runs this season. The 1-1. One, one. Dribble up to Hubbard, who throws on the first again. Another 6-3 put out. And two outs here in the top of the Has had some struggle this week. 0 oh, for 4 during this. But you get here in the Big Ten. This one hit left field. Bannon able to run over to make the catch and gets out of the inning for the Badgers. A one. Molly Schlosser here to lead off the second. Hits this one to the third baseman in Jackson. A little bloop catch there and one pitch, one out in the. Chris Angelopoulos, the catcher, a senior on this squad. Adams today. This one high blooper. Shortstop Bennett. Fighting the sun makes the catch and two pitches. Badgers had three. Batting 234 on the year. This series on first game. Hit off pitch. And strike three looking. Adams gets another strikeout looking. Gets a one, two, three. Now is Breely Kosterman clipping about 253 on the. This one a line drive in the center field. And a leadoff single to start off the inning for Klosterman. Back to back hits. Described her as an energizer bunny. And that was just a really solid hit to Skyland Pogue, one of the later batters in this. The 1 1. Showed it again. And Klosterman able to take second as that ball goes out of the side of Angelopoulos. We are waiting for all the experience they've had. There's a swing and hits it back to Schwartz who throws it on the first. Klosterman got the jump on contact. See now hit your best hitter, Nia Carter. Hits this one, bouncer over Schwartz and she'll be safe at first. 
An RBI single for Carter ties the game up and there are opportunities for Iowa to score and then they left the runner stranded on base. Maybe she didn't realize that was also fouled, just tipped. But now an 0-2 count, 1-2. This one slapped, Hubbard tries to make the diving, he tries to push it over to Crane at second, who couldn't corral, oh. They'll throw on the third base and the umpires will meet up. A They're wild series of And now facing a power hitter and Bennett with two runners on. And Bennett hits this one high. Crane, second baseman, gets under it to make the catch. And now two outs here. Close hit. Base in 265 in scoring position. But it's been a solid two runners on first and second. This one, left field. Bannon ranges over to it. And Wisconsin, Iowa getting four in the first, four in the second. But Ashley now batting. For this squad heading into the postseason. Hit, and nice jab there by Jackson. Throws it on the first, and gets the out. Need for Wisconsin. And that one, driven right field. That is off the wall. Cowher will go in the second, diving head first. Of course it is, a double for Katie Keller. Like we talked about, Keller is really good about getting on base. Do it again. Hit right back up the middle. Keller on her horse home. And she'll be in there diving, gets her hand on the plate. An RBI, an RBI of the day. Kayla Conwin is having a core hitting by Kayla Conwin. And Conwin gets pinched runner relief. It'll be Nevin going in. Going back to Jalen Adams after that play. She's only given up 16. Now bringing in Cuffle. Who walks here. So it'll be runners on first and second as Ellie Hubbard comes up to the plate. Chance now to try and bring in her two runners. Lots of time only. Goes by, drops it right in front of the plate and Pogue's able to tag Nevin. That did not go far. A valley and F bunt didn't go far as it needed to, making it, a, seen a couple of full counts already. Pitch count at 48. And here it comes. This one. High to second base, Baines makes the catch. Wisconsin strands two on base on the corner. Up with the ground out, trying to get some momentum. Payoff pitch, hit center field, and Schlosser is right there under it to record the first out. Blue tinted shades out in center field. Sunny hit. Sherdashny off the chest, throw on the first from Hubbard. A five, six, three. So, could have ruled that a hit. Looking at Avery Jackson. And this one, Schwartz able to get a glove on a great play with the extension, throws on the first and gets an out after the. There's not returning, including Maddie Schwartz, Katie Keller, and Kayla Conwen, who at this point in the season and try and keep their playoff hopes alive. And strike three looking, Jalen Adams gets another strikeout. Oh for one so far on today. One of those seniors, well, trying to avoid one right now. And strike three looking again. Fourth strikeout, fourth looking from Jalen Adams. And then learn the truth. This one hit and through the legs of Bennett at short. Crane aboard. Batting 158, a pair of RBIs. ...has done a really great job rallying. And that's ball four, turns the lineup over. Katie Keller now up to the plate with... Two. So Adams, who started off the inning with a pair of strikeouts. ...out situation. This one swung into center field. Roman is under it, makes the catch. Wisconsin doesn't score. And, uh, Henderson, the pinch hitting sophomore, batting Turpogue. Flee off this inning, and that one high, very shallow right field. Car or Crane able to range over to it to make the catch. One of those three seniors being honored at senior day for Iowa and a spark of this team. Hit right to Keller at first base, who takes it herself and taps the bag. 
Two outs here in the top of the fifth. He describes her as locked in on center field, keeping, coming in as a soft. Hit the crane at second, throws it on to Kyler at first. One, two, three for Schwartz. We head to the bottom of the fifth inning. In this inning, she's used to leading off in some situations as she's let off herself out of this. Doesn't there, ball four, Conlon takes first. Her 34th walk of the year. I'm going to staying on first. Nevin has already substituted for her in today's game. Churns. And hits this one. Jackson at third throws on to second to get Conway. The throw to first, not in time. Watched her first time. Didn't have fielder's choice on that butt attempt in which first. And at one. Ball four and runners up first and second. And we talked about that bunt yesterday. She had helped bring a run. Shows bunt, pulls it back. Mitchell taking third, and she's ruled safe. The throw beat her, but the tag. Situation into what we saw yesterday. Almost the exact situation. Two here. Shows bunt. This one plays, and the flip to home. Got the tag. Mitchell's out at the plate. What? Another it, runner caught out at. Check it out here. Bree Mitchell sliding mm. under. And then Poe trying to get her up. Hubbard at third. Molly Slosher 0 for 2 on. To she takes that one and takes first base. And now it's bases loaded. For in. End this inning. But Emily Bojan, like we talked about this series. She's 0-2. This one hit right to the shortstop at Bennett, who makes the catch. Adams escapes a bases loaded jam. This Iowa team. Rounders to Dashney, who gathers it up, throw on the first. Hits the put out, and one out here in the top of the set. Grounder to Keller, off her chest. She's gonna throw it on the crane at first, and she beats the throw. Hard hit. It's for Iowa, three for the Badgers, and Air each. And there she's taking second throw on, and she's out. Angelopoulos guts her down. Really great. And tag in place. And this hits it to Dashney. Throw on the first. And there's the third out of the inning. Badgers head to the bottom, the sixth. Probably their biggest of the year. Crane shows bunch. She's going to run on the first. Adams, though, able to gather and throw on. Great fielding there by Iowa to She grounded out to Jackson at third. Jalen Adam. Even up 2-2. Two, two. This one blooped in the shallow left field and it finds a gap in fair. Serdashny on board with a six. Make the catch. Serdashny with just a really beautiful. Got a double and then flied out to center field. And with Driven in a right field. Does it have enough at the warning track? And sh she couldn't find it. Roman fighting the sun. Happy about this at all. So Con went now without his loading the bases. That's her fourth time on base. One hits on the year, batting 290. He's all on four home runs. Oh, the game open. And it's this one shallow. Parts doesn't reach, get out of the infield. And there's the catch. Bases loaded situation, two outs. Trying not. Hubbard looking to explode here for the Badgers. And there's a single in the right field. One will score. Two will not as runner is out. Katie Keller for Ellie Hubbard and gives the game of the series having just surrendered one run so far. Payoff pitch hits softly. Crane. Will underhand it to Keller at first, and Schwartz and Badgers are two out away. Something aboard, possible tying run now for any of these hits. Sold out of Iowa. Dribbled up near the middle, Hubbard on the first, and makes the play. One out away from securing the win. And now is a great time. Hit on to Sardash, throws it on the first, and Schwartz and her final game, Matt Goodman, gets the complete game as they head to the Big Ten Tournament.
Wisconsin with their seventh straight victory over the Iowa Hawkeyes. All around play by the Badgers this weekend, both on offense, fielding, pitching, everything running.